Okay, super exciting news for today. I am so happy to show you guys this. This is our brand new book, Expat Guide on Moving to Mexico. Expat's Guide on Moving to Mexico. I'm really excited. It is a monster of a book. Look how thick that is. 475 pages and two years worth of work to put this together. I am so thrilled. I'm so excited to be able to show this to you guys today. So yes, it is. Um, it has been a lot of work. It has been... Uh, many sleepless nights trying to figure things out and put it all together and do a ton of research. I'm going to try to show you the inside of this. So I don't know if you're going to be able to see properly. Maybe this way is better. I'm going to hold it up and then show you. We've got lots of different things in here. I'm going to read you the table of contents in a minute so you kind of know what's involved. But this is like here, even a second ago, we can go through, where is it? There's like the visas and what it looks like for your ID. There is the traffic signs, the, everything that you would need for moving to Mexico. So I am super, super thrilled about this. As I said, two years worth of work to put it together. But I want to show you guys the table of contents so you understand what is in this book, what it contains. So uh, chapter one is all about before you get started, so understanding the mindset and understanding what's involved in this. Uh, then we go into should you move to Mexico, so really dealing with the, the who, where, what, why kind of situation. And then a welcome to Mexico. So the first like 20 pages is just going through the details about Mexico itself. And then we go to welcome to Mexico, really talking about the country. Uh, we get into the history of Mexico, the climate and the weather. We get to an entire chapter just on safety. Um, you know, Mexico is known for being an unsafe place. So we're going to deal with that in the book for sure. Uh, we go how to get to Mexico, stuff that's good to know. Uh, chapter 9 is religion and holidays. Chapter 10 is all on Mexico City. Chapter 11 is best cities for expat living. Uh, chapter 12 is just on pets, so bringing your cats and your dogs and your other pets to Mexico and how you do that. 13 is on language. Uh, chapter 14 is culinary and food. Uh, chapter 15 is cost of living. 16 is health care. 17 is education. 18 is immigration. Uh, chapter 19 is on transportation. Uh, chapter 20 is on real estate in Mexico. Chapter 21 is on packing up your home back home. Um, chapter 22 is working abroad. Chapter 23 is doing business in Mexico. 24 is Mexican taxes. And 25 is bringing it all back together in the conclusion. There you go. 25 chapters, 475 475 pages, you can see there, um, the book. I would say this is certainly the most complete book that has ever been put together on moving to Mexico. I mean, if you needed to go out there and do this research, it would be a full-time thing for years on end. I know because that's what we did to put this together. We did multiple trips to Mexico. We talked to different people from our community at Expat Money Forum. We did a ton of research online. I had conversations with lawyers, with accountants, CPAs, uh, property developers. Um, we got lots of stories for people who did birth tourism there, who's moved there, there themselves. We had conversations with expats who have lived in Mexico for decades, um, people who speak Spanish for fluently and learned in Mexico, people who are moving to Mexico without a word of Spanish. So we did everything we could to put together the most comprehensive book possible on moving to Mexico. And I also just wanted to point out, check out that cover. Can you guys see that? I hope you guys like this cover. I found this incredible, incredible Turkish watercolor artist, and she's doing all of the covers for me. So what we did was we designed this cover, and then I had her go out there and watercolor paint it, and then we high-resolution high scanned it, and we're using it for the covers of the book. So you'll see that there'll be a new theme coming out with all of our new books because we plan on doing a bunch of these books going forward. If this one is a big success, then there will be 20 more of these on different expat countries. So I'm really proud of it. I hope you guys want to check it out. There's going to be a link in the description behind um, underneath this video where you can go to Amazon and you can pick this up. It's going to be in bookshelves as well around the country. But um, because we just launched, the book is, I think, only in one or two bookstores right now. I think mostly the best place to be able to get it is from Amazon. So you can either search for Expat's Guide on Moving to Mexico um, or my name, Mikkel Thorpe, M-I-K-K-E-L-T-H-O-R-U-P, or 
click the link below and you'll be able to pick this up. Uh, do me one favor. When you do pick it up, when you buy the book, when you read through it, I want you to go back to Amazon and you got to leave us a review. Was the book helpful? Did you enjoy it? Was it comprehensive? Was it easy to follow, clear? Um, leave us your comments in there. And if you like the book, make sure to give us a five-star review because that will show Amazon and any other seller that we uh, have the book on that the book has a lot of value and it's very popular and it needs to be shown to more people. We're on a mission here. We want to try to get the word out. We really believe that being an expat and the offshore markets are the clearest and best way to freedom. And the way that I know how to do that is really to write and talk about it. And that's what we're doing. And I hope that you guys enjoy the book. So that's it for me today. Nice and quick video. I hope you guys are excited about it as I am. Expat's Guide on Moving to Mexico. Thanks so much.